Today's telecast is presented live from Baltimore, Scaryland. And we're at B&D Spank Stadium for today's game. The stadium is sold out and the atmosphere is electric. The fans want to see some hard-hitting carnage, <laughs> and so do I. I heard the city was famous for crabs. So if you get lucky tonight, Grim, make sure you take a shampoo with that Quell lotion and see a doctor. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Diamond Crackings battle. The Baltimore Razors. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, well, hmm. uh, no, no, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. And he laterals at the last second. Oh, nice hit. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut, and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, eight. That ball was almost intercepted. Four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Eight. And with a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. And how about a little dirt sandwich?
Second down and two. Oh, and the defense jumps on time. And on some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yes. it plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Second down in a very lot. One, hot two, hot Good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly blew three times the legal limit last night leaving the stadium. And I nearly did not get arrested, get thrown face first into a paddy wagon, get taken for a rough ride. And I nearly did not have prison sex and lockup last night. Nearly ain't a good thing, Grim. Trust me. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one. Eight. I don't remember calling 911, but the SWAT team is out in full force at the line of scrimmage. Nice play by the linemen. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. He's at the third. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a soft on Friday on this asshole. <laughs> Landmines in the end zone during the dance celebrations. <laughs> Be a lot more entertaining, that's for sure. <laughs> now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Boom. 
second down and two. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Hot. 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 And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Hey. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Third down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. No, you didn't see it. <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pan, Grim. You're right. Caught for the first down. First and ten. Defense holds him to a four yard pick up there. Second down and six. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and six. He turned into a mutant fireball with that flame on the trip. And anything he touches gets whooping. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. Well, surprise me, he made it look easy and he gets three points for it. And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. Yeah, we 
Seven. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all you can eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She had 47 seconds. Two minutes left in the half. First and ten. And that's a pick. And now the quarterback is. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And it's first and ten. Personally, I think that the ginormous guy is comp. Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he first. Look, guys, I'm supposed to be impartial, but this rep is so dirty, he should be where he's most at home, buried in the dirt. <laughs> First down and less than a yard. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Six-yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step they stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. <laughs> oh, the defender lays down a wicked hit and knocks the ball loose. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Whoa. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. the 
extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Wow, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blast for me. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. Catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Second down, and that'll be their final timeout. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? How many times we have? That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, I'm gonna go to a strip tease show. Where we going? <laughs> hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Second down in a mile. And that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. And I'm two fists into this bottle of scotch. First and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, great throw, great catch, and then put six points on the board.
want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And he laterals the ball. Man, these guys like playing high. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Second and eight to go. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go. He's unstuck. And he's running like a... He could go all the way. And the defense is on his heels. The 20. Somebody get that guy a beer, because he just saved me a thousand bucks. First and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! And yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brave Man with a ball that didn't fall down. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, oh, my bad. Second down and two. Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third and two. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks.
First and eight to go. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Second down in a very lot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Third down and ten. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. You've got to catch that. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Football is a team sport, and that's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And that'll be second down and four. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Well, good luck. And he breaks away. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First down and nine. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It's good. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's 
It's first and ten. The cornerback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. And like bricks and bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. He's at the ten. He scores! Point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I gotta. Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Not much there, maybe a yard. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Sandwich. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. First and ten. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the frayed cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is... Ah, I forgot my point. And it's first and ten. Keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Second and three. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. It looks like the defense handed out shrinking pills. Uh, that's a ginormous dirty trick there, Bricks. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. 
The defense calls their first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait, what? You're married? Mm, it's complicated. One, hot two, hot three. And this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon down there. And that'll give him four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And with one timeout remaining, the defense has to get something going here. And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the juggle. If he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, kiss can say, what the fuck the fuck a fuck? First down and five. And it's about a three yard pickup. The defense takes its final timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore, so they'll need to stop the offense. Second down and two. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell rung for a yard. And that'll bring up third and one. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Huh? It's a fair question. Third down, and the punter is warming up. The Razors lose and walk away bruised, beaten, and broken. Kind of like a trip to the inner harbor when the public schools have the day off, Grim. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotropism. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Newton Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...